find the fourth term of the expansion 3x minus y squared to the 5. Here is our formula for term number k plus 1. And that's nck times the first term to the power of n minus k times the second term to the power of k. Great. So fourth term, which means that k plus 1 is 4, so k is 3. And we know that nck is equal to n factorial all over k factorial times n minus k factorial. Great, so we're looking for term 4. And we have 5c3 because our k, or sorry, our n is 5 and our k is 3 times the first term, which is 3x to the power of n minus k times the second term, which is negative y squared to the power of k. Great, now we want to know 5c3. So 5 factorial, all over 3 factorial, 2 factorial. Once again, I'll mention it. I'll do it quickly because we have done it on the website before, and you can check it out right here under combinatorics, how to do combinations and factorials. So these guys cancel out. We get 5 times 2, which is 10. So plug the 10 in here for 5c3. And we have 3x squared, because 5 minus 3 is 2. And negative y squared to the power of 3, or just negative y squared cubed, is negative y to the power of 6. Because the cube, the 3, multiplies the 2. So now we can just combine everything. 10 times 3, 30. And, oh yeah, we have the negative here, so that'll make a negative 30 x squared. And I just made a big mistake, actually. So let's correct that. First, I need to distribute the squared for both elements. And I had not squared the 3. So let's do that. So 10 times 9 x squared. I actually did that intentionally, just so that, you know, keep everyone on their toes. Uh, 10 times 9, 90, times negative 1 hidden here. That's negative 90. And we have still x squared y to the 6. And if you don't believe me when I said that I did that intentionally, that's okay. So that's the final answer. The fourth term of the expansion is negative 90 x squared y to the 6.